So in general, there are always going to be deficiencies and challenges in your soil. Today, we're gonna to look at one solution that you've probably been missing, amino acids. Let's get into it. So the two components that we're constantly working to balance in the garden is the fertility on one side, all of your nutrients, and then the biology, all the microbes, bacteria, fungus on the other side. The role that those play together, the biology unlocking the nutrients for those plants, making them bioavailable, is this endless dance that we're in. But amino acids are a really important uh, component in that soil web in terms of making uh, nutrients bioavailable and helping to unlock the key components that those plants need. So today we're going to highlight three key roles that the amino acids play that you may not be aware of, that if you introduce these different amino acid products into your cultivation, you're going to see better results. So the three keys are the role that amino acids play in nitrogen and making nitrogen bioavailable to your plants. The second component is the way that amino acids help to chelate calcium and make calcium more bioavailable to your plants. And the third is the way that those amino acids become phenomenal food source for the uh, biology in your soil. So those are the three components we wanna key into. And we're gonna start with a phenomenal product from a local Oregon company, Down to Earth called Agmino. Agmino has been in our lineup for quite some time. It's a soybean protein hydrolysate that they developed. It's a 1400 NPK, so clearly nitrogen heavy. And amino acids in general, in nature, right, in, in the wild, uh, amino acids are that primary dominant source of nitrogen for plants. So uh, through a series of magical and miraculous soil chemistry, uh, amino acids can get converted into uh, nitrogen for those trees and plants in the wild. And in our cultivation here at our facility, it's no different. We're making that, that uh, uh, nitrogen bioavailable to those plants through a product like Agmino. The other uh, amino acid product that we absolutely love, another local Oregon company, Nectar for the Gods, with their Athena's Aminas, is a product that we use primarily in flour and it is a immediately bioavailable form of amino acids that we look to for that calcium chelation. And calcium is, as we've shown in, in one of our previous episodes, probably the single most important nutrient in that plant, uh, in the plant system. Without a proper bioavailable calcium to that plant, your plants are gonna suffer, period. So the Athena's Aminas in our regimen is, is an insurance policy to make sure that all the calcium that we've worked so hard to get into our soil is made bioavailable to that plant. And then the third component is uh, fish emulsion. Fish emulsion is a classic input that my dad used in the garden. One of my earliest childhood memories is that super gnarly stink of a fish emulsion bottle. And it's been in the garden forever because it just works. It's a phenomenal source of a balanced NPK, but it really is about the amino acids in there. So all of that dissolved fish hydrolysate uh, provides a phenomenal source of amino acids. So whenever we're making compost teas and we're looking to drive that biology, we always send some fish emulsion in with it. So you're ensuring that all that biology has that food source to keep it multiplying the way that you want into the trillions and uh, then heading, hitting your soil and doing all that good work for you. So uh, a, a really quick, simple PSA today on amino acids and the importance that they have in your cultivation regimen. Something in your veg cycle that is gonna stoke out uh, the plants with that good nitrogen source something that you ensure is always present in your flower cycle to chelate that calcium, and that you've got something in your mix that's always helping to feed those microbes. So remember, all of those components work in synergy, and all of your cultivation is going to be improved if you ensure that you've got those amino acids present. So get after it, and let's cultivate.